If you're counting on a professional boat crew to arrive and help you out, then it's important that they get there quickly and safely. Turns out that this is not always an easy task, and all too often, boat crews can get it wrong. Let's explore some new concepts on high-speed vessel operations and navigation. The days of drawing a circle on the chart and labeling it present position are over. Boats and ships are moving faster and faster. 30 knots, 40 knots. Some vessels are hurtling along at more than 50 knots. Believe me, at 50 knots, any pencil mark you leave on the chart is ancient history. It's funny how things change. When I went to navigation school, it was all about knowing where you are. Yet at these speeds, you never really know where you are. You only ever know where you're not. Positive control is a combination of situational awareness and the ability of your crew to manage any threats or errors immediately. The critical elements are instrument integrity, quality of information, and a recent flow of two-way communications. These tools allow your team to make sound decisions and keep the vessel on course. Dynamic navigation. This is a carefully orchestrated technique used to guide your craft through a turn or alteration without wiping out or colliding with anyone or anything. When we watched crews around the world conduct their daily business, it was surprising to us how similar the routine was. Here, let's watch a Swedish Forces CB90 crew go through a turn. You'll see what I mean. The green cross on the screen is tracking the driver's eyes. His attention is almost completely engaged on the immediate area outside the boat. He's judging distances off the rocks, and he's predicting the path of the vessel throughout the turns. This is how decisions are made at these speeds. The coxswain or the driver is absorbed in the present, yet the navigator does all his work in the future. In England, Canada, and Sweden, trainers are using simulation to develop these skills before the crews go out on high-risk operations. 